Hello, it's Thursday, August the 18th, 2011, and I'm Martin Smith with the Daily Outlook from Maxiforex. The US dollar fell against most major currencies due to an increase in risk aversion. Stock markets closed mixed after the Dow Jones rose by 0.04% and the Nasdaq lost 0.47%. Crude oil rose by 0.45% and closed at $87.40 a barrel. Gold strengthened by 0.10% to close at $1,788 an ounce. The decline of the dollar is increasing demand for all things priced in the currency, such as oil and gold. Today, core CPI is expected to grow by 0.20% versus 0.30% previously. Unemployment claims are expected to rise by 402,000 versus 395,000 previously, and existing home sales by 4.91 million versus 4.77 million prior. The euro strengthened against the US dollar, again due to the increase in risk aversion. Participants remain hopeful that Merkel and Sarkozy will announce a common eurozone bond in the near future that will provide a tailwind for the euro. Trading above the support level of 143.80 will keep the momentum positive for the pair. Overall, the euro dollar traded with a low of 143.23 and a high of 145.16. Today, no economic data is expected. Despite MPC minute, meet, minute, meeting minutes, we're reading that all members of the policy board voted to keep rates unchanged. The pound strengthened to a fresh three and a half month high against the greenback. The trend for the pair remains bullish if the pair maintains its support level of 164.40. But if it breaks that support, it may reach 161.50. Overall, the pound dollar traded with a low of 163.17 and a high of 165.91. Today, retail sales are expected to grow by 0.30% versus 0.70% prior. The yen continued to fluctuate against the US dollar after Japan indicated that it's ready to intervene in foreign exchange markets again. The dollar yen has been struggling between the 76.50 and 76.90 levels. Overall, the, the dollar yen traded with a low of 76.59 and a high of 77.09. No economic data is expected today. The Canadian dollar fell against its US counterpart, touching the strongest level in a week as stocks ended the day higher and crude oil, the nation's biggest export, rose. The trend for the pair will turn bearish if it breaks its support level of 0.9780. Today, wholesale sales are expected to grow by 0.30% versus 1.90% previously. Well, that's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.